Hello and welcome to the Z Hut. Today I'd like to show you how to have a button link to a website in MIT App Inventor 2. All right, to get started, first you got to open up the MIT App Inventor. And we'll go over here under user interface, we're going to need a button. Now you can put text in the button that you want it to say, um, use a picture, whatever you want, but for this tutorial I'm just showing you how to connect to a website with a button. So we have to drag in a button here first, then go down to connectivity, and we need to drag in an activity starter. Now that's all we need here in the designer, so we can go over to the blocks. So first we'll go up to, whoops, not control, we want to go to button and grab when button one's clicked, then go to the activity starter and we want set data URI, where is that? Data URI right here. Then we need a text box. Now, in this text box, this is where we put the website that we're linking to. So let's just put something in. We'll just do YouTube.com. So what will happen is when this button is clicked, it will take you to the YouTube web website. But we got to do one more thing. We got to go to the activity starter again, and we want activity action two. Drag that in here, and we need another text box. Now, in this text box, we have to put a specific command in there, and I'm just going to copy it out of another window I have open. You want to put Android dot intent dot action dot view. You want to put it in just like this, with capital letters on the view, everything else lowercase. Then one final step before it'll work, go back to Activity Starter and call Start Activity. All right. <coughs> Let me open up the emulator, and here's our button. I push the button. And there we go. It brings us to YouTube. Well, that's all there is to it. This is pretty simple to do. So I hope you found this information useful. If you did, please give us a thumbs up. I would appreciate it. Have a great day. Hope to see you here again.